I wanted to go to Columbia because of its reputation as, you know, one of the leading medical schools in the United States. But also I wanted to be in New York because of the food from New York. Before going to medical school, I actually moved to New York to go to cooking school. I cooked in New York uh, for a few years and then decided to go back to medical school. Columbia was honestly a, a dream school for me. And lo and behold, you know, I ended up getting in and uh, it's, it's really a fantastic uh, story and, and dream of mine. I got involved with the Alumni Association actually while I was a student uh, going to medical school in my second year. When the Alumni Association found out that I was a chef, I started to make desserts for the annual Columbia Medical School Alumni Association reunion. And then I ended up joining on the board of the Alumni Association after residency as the vice treasurer to treasurer to vice president to, um, to now the president. This year has been incredibly difficult for everyone around the world with this uh, global pandemic. And as a board certified anesthesiologist, I was working on the front lines. I had to wear special equipment and it was stressful. Here was a patient that was, you know, struggling to survive. And I was the, you know, only one there that could, you know, stabilize them at the moment. At the same time, the risk was very big for me and, you know, not just myself, but my family. And so it was stressful. I had the opportunity to team up with the uh, CAA, with the alumni in Asia. And this was a grassroots effort to bring adequate PPE from China to New York, N95 masks, face shields, gowns. And we were able to raise over uh, $2.1 million uh, in China, get the adequate PPE and bring them over. And I was part of the team to do the logistics to distribute them. And honestly, that project was hands down the most meaningful thing I've done, <laughs> period. I owe so much to Columbia. You know, I, I wouldn't be the doctor that I am today without the help from everything that Columbia has done. So, you know, I, I feel honored and, and blessed to be able to have that opportunity to give back to the community that helped me 